I don't know, I'm not ready to move front door yet. Well, that was fun. Peachy spent the time together, but I gotta go. <laughs> Any were but right here. There's a couple of places that seem to require marked up here, so I suppose we could throw them up onto the map, eh? Oh, it's me. Ripple effect. Thought it was a fishies there for a second. I actually was doing that uh, first time Far Harbor came out. I was doing that Captain's Dance about killing all the mirror lurk and all the rest of it and looked around and seen a fish. That was it. Completely distracted. Chasing after the fish going fishies like a complete banana. And that's me being polite about myself. And was getting attacked by mirror, mirror lurk from behind. Well, I choose the fish. Oh, okay. I really do need to get more ten mills going here. I love clearing this place out. Yes, I remember the Citadel. I love the Citadel. I immediately miss the Commonwealth, the Capital Wasteland. That's one big lad. I actually seriously miss the Capital Wasteland. Would like to go back to the Wasteland at some point. That would be nice if I could actually travel back to the Wasteland. What problem? What problem? Yeah, you lost it, I haven't. Then again, Dan said, so you lost it a long time ago, mate. I'm going to try to take out Shadow, I'm just going to hit the cover. Mutant Slayers Institute Rifle, why? Does 50% more damage against Super Mutants. Nice, but yeah, I'm still not going to carry it. I'll sell it to someone. More than likely Tegan. Skimwalkers, what? Shambles and ferals? I would go more with zombies. Uh, that, that, that was more my take on them. Personally, I don't think anybody needs a zombie mod for this game. We've got zombies. This is anything but cleared. Really? So what's this thing? Seriously, godless heathen? Dude. It's a zombie. In my eyes, that's what they are. They've lost it completely. They eat people. They're zombies. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, I decided this. 
for me. Everybody else can call them whatever they want, but that's what I'm going to call them. Oh, I spy with my little eyes something we've been getting with. Yes, please. No, that just made me a very happy bunny. Eh, no. Yep, that is one of the reasons if the world was to end, I would want to live in the United States of America. Weaponry. <laughs> so much easier to come across. That probably sounds awful, but it's true. I mean, don't get me wrong, I could find a mother load of weaponry in any country, you know what I mean? Sweet. But in the States, it's, you know, because of the fact that people are, are allowed to be armed, you know what I mean? It would be easier to come across it than it would here. I mean, don't get me wrong, we're allowed gun licenses in the brain, but especially here in, in, in my part of the world, in my little country part of the world, it is not as easy to actually hold a gun license as it is in the United States of America. And it's basically because of everything that happened here. It's not that easy to actually hold a gun license. So um, it would actually make life a hell of a lot easier to live in the United States of America because it's easier to get a gun license, basically, compared to what we have here in the North. Um, so yeah, don't get me wrong, there are a lot of weapons that are illegal, you know what I mean, a major load here, and in the rest of the United Kingdom, you know, if you're talking about legally held weapons, the legally held weapons compared to, but then again saying that, the size of our country compared to the United States of America, we're minuscule, we are minute compared to the size of the United States, so, you know, you would sort of expect, in size terms, you know, that there would actually be a little bit more weaponry at least, you know, but we are actually min minute compared to the United States of America. It is a big ass country. You know, so, uh, very different thing going on there, like, um, but it is definitely, uh, if the world ended, one country I would rather actually be in than here. For the simple fact that it would be a little bit easier to survive. I do like my weaponry, as you have seen. I'm a guns guard. And frags. I love my frags. I'm not clearing this all out. I will do that whenever we actually get the whenever we actually get our hands on the place. I'll clear it out. But right now no I'm not clearing the light. Right, what's that? I'm pointed towards you. Yeah, I've got that march out, so we'll go there. Uh, I really do need more ten mils badly. That's a big enough little settlement there, so it is. Take Fuck me! Where the... Did that come from? I can't believe I actually just walked right past that. I'm an idiot. I am a first degree idiot. 
He's not actually usually there. You know that orphanage I was over by? That's usually where you find that. Keep an eye on me, Dancing. I'm going to shoot you. Again. On purpose this time. Personal space, big guy. Many times we'll have to have this conversation. You're getting into my personal space. That is not a good place to be in. Alright. What's that marked up? Uh, where are we going? Just shot up. Have you noticed how many of the trappers all seem to be redheads? Raiders as well. They all look remarkably like what's her face? Kate. Anybody else notice that one? do with them to shrink the stuff down when we can. Sucky time to run on the bullets when I'm done. They would have to have escaped from hell first, dude. Ugh. Hitman's Institute rifle right? says one ten percent while aiming. Yeah, I don't do much aiming at the moment. It's probably why all my shots are going wild so badly. It's an awful lot of hip there. And you know, there's a lot of hip fire. Oh, I found a double bath. Mattresses are a bit geeked on, not like, but you know. Big guy seriously could turn the stairs. Keep walking. Keep walking. 